nice. Probably uses both. If I can just get it free. Think so fast. Fred, left flank. No. He's stuck. already off to a lively start. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. <laughs> What's the chain in the water for? That'd be a dwarven supply ferry. Said ferry appears to be missing. Huh. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have uh, become that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. There are resources. You never asked Mom about what she used to do. What did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know, it is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Looks like the past continues on the other side of that geyser. Tyr was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the Rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's gotta be a faster way to get down there. Go! 
Okay, there's got to be some way to turn the wheel up here. Well there! Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartelfine. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. <laughs> Wow, nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not as cold as I made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spotify? My lad, Thimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Thimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. Raid Mars Brasser, father of a few dwarves you may be well familiar with. Rock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. we can fit under that bridge?
Hey, father, up there. Find anything good up there? Cap those geysers. Hmm. Hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? Ingenuity for you. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Rock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, 
All too often, people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. And how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. <laughs> Gotta get behind it. How? <laughs> Must be a better vantage point. Somewhere we can attack it without it seeing us. See what it dropped. Oh. Come there. Gotta be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. <laughs> Think you can uncover that geyser from here? Oh, I think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. coming down.
That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History. <laughs> Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being in prison for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. That earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow, now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellia, brothers. Hey, towards. Oh, they're uh, running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. How that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Hey, could we talk we to you for... Any trouble. Please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in. The buildings here really are incredible. The detail in the woodwork is quite extraordinary. of Odin? They must really love him here. Or fear him. Hmm? Sindri! Hello! I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. <laughs> One Raven down. What is a dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oof, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material... Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something... Uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it. What's it gonna be this time? <sighs> Patience! I find it's best to see these things... In action! Ah! Whew! <sighs> there. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say, Skialfa.
Well, I certainly didn't expect you to serve half the creepy crawlies in need of a lair. How was I supposed to know they were there? Right side, <laughs> Okay, so, Derlin. Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. So this lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an Odinism if I ever have one. Another of Cavassia's poems. 